let's get back to this. I'll I'd recap it, but you know the game likes to Tama, do that for me. As long as you're with me, I can keep going. Here to see me on stage, perhaps? I hate him! It's my most precious treasure. Huh. Shoma isn't here. If the cops investigate any further, they'll make them disappear. All right, then. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, fine. I'll answer what the thing wants. Also, I do hope that it doesn't. Um, what kind of vintage items do you like? Uh... You know what? Sure, instruments. Uh -huh. <laughs> um, yeah, but what I was going to say is I hope it doesn't make me, uh, redo where I went before I, uh, went up here. I feel like I reloaded something. Well, you know, actually, I'll go check the flow charts. Oh, that's right. Because I did the, um... Yeah, well, it still counts as me having gone to the amusement park, so that should be fine. I shouldn't have to redo that. Okay. That's good. Talk to MoMA, talk to the receptionist. Oh, I did the Atami thing. Talk to Sniper Lady. Okay, I think I investigated and talked to everything and everyone other than Iris. She's recording, but she doesn't look tired at all. She's truly professional, high on sugar all the time, probably. Sugar and caffeine. Two days ago, we were talking about the people who went missing after seeing Bats 490. That's right. Well, the same thing started happening with the people who saw the QR code video. Wait, what? What? I read about it online this morning. Many people have gone missing since seeing that video. So it's the moral of this story, don't go watching then trying to decode really weird <laughs> ARG videos you see on YouTube. Rumors say that the missing people are being rounded up in one location and they're all getting murdered. Uh You there. Yes, sniper mask? Is what you just said true? Huh? Y yeah Who the hell are you? Don't get one step closer. Th that's right. What are you trying to do to Tessa? Sorry to bother you. <sighs> are you a good gone. guy? What was that all about? Um, about our discussion. Now what I'm trying to figure out is if... Because I'm normally good at being able to tell voice actors. But what I'm trying to figure out is if... That's the voice actor of someone I've heard in the game so far. Just with a, um... Voice filter. Like what happened in, uh... Fire Emblem Three Houses, where the, uh... Well, you could tell who the uh, Flame Emperor was. Who the Flame Emperor was just by knowing, like, the uh, voice actors and that, since you could still recognize it a bit under the uh, <clears throat> under the voice filter of the mask. Though, really, that's probably just due to me having a lot of experience um, watching and playing things with English audio, because that's typically what I use when it's available. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to figure out if the Mass Sniper Lady is 
Someone we actually know and have heard so far? I mean, they probably are, but... Like, if the voice actor they're using for them when they're the mass sniper is actually the same voice actor as for their normal self, or if it's a different one to try and keep us thrown off. Oh, right. Oh, also one more thing. On the, uh... I realized after the last one, since I had the theory about, um, <clears throat> about Amame possibly being, uh, boss's daughter, because, like, her birthday is in August, it matches up with the last year thing, um, that, you know, she had mentioned at one point it was just her and her mom, and that, you know, because I went to look at the other, like, three people that were the age of, um, you know, three characters that were the age of where Boss said her daughter was, was, and, you know, just by process of elimination, it would have had to have been her if it was someone there, because it is starting to get brought up a lot. Um, also, there was a thing about, from the first game, where Mizuki stayed with, uh, stayed out of Mame's house, and if that also happened to be Boss's house, then that, you know, then that does make sense and add things up that way. Um, I don't know what any plot relevance any of that would have, though, and I'm probably just, I'm probably just off on some crazy thing here. Whatever. Either way, obviously, I, I don't want to know until, or unless, you know, until the time it actually gets mentioned in game, if it does at all. But it will be amusing if I did actually call that, considering um, a friend and I called the whole uh, Sigma and Phi situation um, in the Zero Escape series before, uh, <laughs> before the. Zero Time Dilemma was even announced, let alone released. <laughs> uh, anyway, back, back to this. Did someone you know go missing or something? No, it's not that. Alright. It's just a rumor I found online. Mm. Tama, how many people have gone missing lately? It's gonna be like, what, thousands? thousand About or something? 1,700 people have gone missing this week. That seems exceptionally high. It isn't particularly higher than usual. It's really fucked up, but that's not a notably high number. Mm. There's something paranormal going on in the HB case after all. Uh, at least for like a country like, like half a corpse Japan, where like you think another world. things are I mean, presented. And people as going missing different. after watching a video. There has to be some sort of supernatural phenomenon happening. Because they're always Japan is always seen as like more orderly and like organized, and you know, like things are much more. You know, is that they have it together and have this violence and stuff. Typically, that is how it gets talked about. Some people I know that have gone there, or how people I've seen that move there mention it. But I don't know. Um, <clears throat> I agree with Tessa. Of course, I mean I'm Canadian, so maybe our numbers are somehow really high too. I don't know. The occult are involved with the HB case for sure. Probably. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Nice is a part of all of this, right? Where did you hear that? It's all over the internet. How is it? Nice is a big proponent of the simulation theory. Right. Oh, and I didn't know this a few months ago. I learned all this recently. You learned it all because uh, Iris mentioned it, right? If you think about that theory being correct, the case makes a lot more sense. After all, we are living in nothing but a simulation. And yeah. such programs always have some glitches lurking under the surface. Coincidences like this are a manifestation of such glitches. Proof of imperfection. Proof of the scenes. Alright. <laughs> I am not Winks and Good. I am curious 
if they can only... Can only wink sync one of them. Wait. <laughs> I know it's probably going to be funny if I do, but I'm... I'm not going to... Should I... They're just good. They're saying that it's just gonna be Iris, like so we don't really know. We'll see what she's got. Why not? It might be plot relevant. Uh, um, it's nice to meet you. I've never been in such a big manner before. I'm feeling a bit nervous. Is this Kazuna's death? Y yes, I'm good. Oh, you watched my stream? Thank you. I'm no expert on paranormal and occult stuff, but I know one thing for sure, so I gotta warn you. Okay. You should back out of this investigation. What uh, do you mean? I don't know much about that nice group, but there's definitely a real dangerous organization involved in all this. I mean, you're probably right. If you right. get too deep, you might end up dead. No, can't argue against that thought process. Word's spreading in the underground. If the cops investigate any further, they'll make them disappear. Oh shit. It seems like the rich and powerful from all over the world are involved in this too. You piss them off. Who knows what they'll do to you? <laughs> rich and powerful? Could Mr. Sajima be involved in this too? Uh... Sajima? So Sajima the con. You mean the former politician guy? Yes, so Sajima. You mean your dad? <laughs> I, I don't think Daddy Dearest is involved in this, Cyrus. <laughs> oh, but don't worry about it. I just saw him recently, so he popped in my head is all. Oh. I see. Wait, you met with So? Yeah. Why? Because he invited me to his house. Yeah. For what reason? He said he happened upon my videos online and thought they were interesting or something like that. What, is he trying to connect with his daughter or something? Are you okay? He didn't do anything, did he? Not at all. We just talked for a bit. Hmm. Iris doesn't know So Sejima is her father. She doesn't? After the new Cyclops serial killing, So Sejima's life as a politician ended. However, what So did wasn't technically illegal, so he hasn't been arrested or charged. So has tons of money. He may not be a politician anymore, but he still holds tons of power. Yeah. Or the fact that he was involved in the murder of her real mother, Monica. Which was done by her brother. Yeah, the people around her have been protecting her from that information. Fortunately, Iris doesn't really watch the news either. But in any case, the media hasn't found out Iris is Monica's father. Nor should they. I honestly thought someone would tell Iris, and maybe at the six years in the future she'll have known. But all right. The simulation know. theory is probably true. There's even proof. Proof? Take a look at this. All right. What do you got? Doesn't this remind you of something? Like those nameless mob characters that show up in video games. You know they reuse assets to lower production costs. Yeah, I know. It's almost like they're reusing character models for this game for some of the older characters. Instead of giving, you know, like boss or pewter new clothes or anything. No, this is probably just some sort of coincidence. Like some synchronicity type thing? But there's more photographic proof. Alright. It'd be weird if I, if the simulation thing happened and I didn't hate it yet. 
hated when Star Ocean did that. Let me on. In a nutshell, they're basically meaningful coincidences. For example, when you talk about someone and they just so happen to show up in front of you. Right. Or when you hear the same word over and over from a bunch of different people. <clears throat> that kind of synchronicity. It's supposed okay. to mean that there's a message behind it. A message from who? Hell if I know. Well, someone. Do you still think it's a coincidence after seeing this? If you consider this stuff that can't be explained by science as a glitch in the simulated world... That's a car driving on a road. <laughs> it can't be. Calm down, Ryuki. These are obviously doctored photos. Oh shit, hang on, I'm gonna sneeze. Oh. I mean, yeah, photos can be easily doctored. Yeah, you're right. Listening to Ota. <laughs> He's batshit crazy, and I don't want to be around him anymore. You can explain any paranormal phenomenon using the simulation theory. UFOs, Umas, Uma? ghosts, superpowers. What was an Uma? If this world is a simulation, like they Thurman? all be possible. Yeah, whether it's a glitch or alterations made on purpose, whatever it is, would all make sense. Uh. Now, let's get going. For all that talking we did, we didn't get much useful information here. Yeah. But something has been bothering me. What's that? I'll keep what I heard here in mind, just in case. Alright. I know I already tipped the department store, but it's probably gonna make me, yeah. It's probably going to make me go through this again. So what I'll do um, what I'll do since I you know, had it done oh. yeah, that's true. Yes, yes, you lied about the thing, I know. You... That robot you showed me the other day was. If you're that skilled, I'm sure you. I'm just. But even the one. Wait, like. Mm -hmm. I told you before, she's we're not friends. Supposedly she's attending school from, but I guess her permanent ad. That's why she goes to the same school. So you do know a lot about. No. That doesn't mean anything! Not like I'm even slightly interested in that uggo. Well, he really is a kid, huh? Alright, fine. You know what? I'll just. What love? I. My friends me. I bring. Yeah, I, I already, yeah. Uh... Just and I don't want I... to. Yeah, I, I didn't want to, uh, you know. I normally wouldn't skip over something, but if it's literally something that was in the last video. Um, would, of course, make more sense to... Boy, to I'm glad you invited me on the Ferris wheel, too. Used to be a. This is the only. Okay. Not a. I. Right, you were afraid that happened. Wink sink him. Just pop Jojo pose inside the gondola. Like that. 
supposed Okay. So it's so she went to see so Sure to see so he had the, all that stuff done to go and check, so I'm curious about the other. No wait, I would have already gone through this. Uh, I'll go see my, I'll go to Marble and see Mama after. Huh? Ryuki, why are you here? Oh. Okay. To question people for the investigation. Why are you two here? Well, I mean, Kazuna's probably here because her dad is... Kizzy comes here uh... to play with the kids sometimes. Oh. She really loves kids. Yes, I find it quite soothing. And it energizes me. <laughs> but they're evil. They are pure evil. <laughs> I'm just tagging along. That makes sense. Mizuki could probably fit in with the kids pretty good. <laughs> She's gonna smack you. I feel like I just got insulted. Mind if I kick your ass? <laughs> Vixis is quite popular with the children here. She played with them often when she was still living with Mr. Date as well. Wait, isn't she still living with Mr. Date? I mean, with Date, why do I keep saying that? Ah. Uh... I don't drink, so I don't know. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I don't drink, I don't know this stuff. And I don't particularly care to. So I'm going that still coded like color coded like the other thing slide Ooh, a tree a seesaw and there's not cor a correcchio in sight Shits are in the background. <laughs> oh, so you want to get kicked? Your thoughts are written all over your face. I see. School's closed because of the flu. We won't oh. have classes for a while. Then aren't you supposed to stay at home? A certain freeloader is at home all the time because he's on vacation. It was so annoying. I had to get outside. <laughs> she must mean Mr. Date. Young girls have wills of their own. It's all right now because I am here. <laughs> Half might. What? You just seemed kind of quiet. So I thought maybe you weren't feeling well. What? I'm always like this. Though, now that you mention it, I guess my old leg wound is bothering me a bit. Oh, from when you, where you got shot? Wait, where are you looking, perv? Huh? You brought it up. By the way, is that a bullet wound? Yeah. Doesn't it hurt? No, not really. It's from when I got shot by the new Cyclops killer. But I think the pain I felt inside was worse. Now I'll yeah. be scarred forever because of that bastard. <laughs> the irony being the that bastard she's talking about is probably Dante because he's just indeed she's just being we have been quite close. No, no, I'm I'm overthinking. Some it. time ago, when I nearly got in trouble with some delinquents in town, Mr. Dante saved me. Since then, I have been showing my gratitude with home cooked meals. 
or booking a hotel room for him if he is unable to go home for whatever reason. Like when we got in a big fight and I kicked him out. As we continue to interact, <laughs> we have come to form a sort of mutually beneficial relationship. You must like Mr. Date, Kizuna. Yes, but merely as a friend. She was pretty direct about it. Yep. <laughs> that old vibrating bed of a man would never be a viable romantic candidate. Ah, uh, we did not get much of a chance to speak yesterday. Mm -hmm. For various reasons, I have been living with another girl since I was nine years old. Another okay. girl? Not your relative. No, we were not related by blood. <clears throat> we were the same age, but I referred to her as Big Sis. She was so beautiful, collected, and dependable. She was the spitting image of an older sister. There is something about Mizuki that reminds me of her. Hmm, I see. Beautiful and collected, huh? Why does that look in your eyes offend me so much right now? <laughs> is she not with you anymore? When she turned 15, she was adopted. So, we do not live together any longer. But she's the same age. <laughs> okay, but... Let's well, show us a wrench and things. I mean, suppose that could still be a mommy, because <laughs> honestly, I wouldn't see Boss actually having a daughter young. I mean, maybe, and, and if it was a mom, it would explain why she doesn't really have, like, eye color or, or whatever, like, features that resemble Boz. Hmm. I, I'm probably getting all caught up on this, but, yeah. Oh, nothing. Being here takes me back. So, what is it you wish to discuss? F father Oh, hello. And who is this? Mr. Ryuki, from the police. He is investigating the HB case. I see. It's a pleasure to meet you. My name is Kuruto Ryuki <coughs> from the Metropolitan Police Department. May I ask you some questions? That's fine, but I don't have much time. I would appreciate it if you're quick about it. I feel like I just... No, I'm, I'm fine. <laughs> I mean, I'm always worried about life to some extent, but no, not. It's about it. Indeed I am. An investor and founder of the Chieda Foundation, you're also the chief director of Iowan, and a major shareholder of Horadori Institute of Genetics, is that right? And all of that has kept me quite busy. So, you already know all that about me. What more do you want me to say? Why are you being such a jackass? Easily chill the fuck out, dude. <sighs> this guy's a piece of work. It's a piece of something, huh? He obviously doesn't respect us. I mean, he is one of the wealthiest people on Earth. A police officer is probably like an aunt to him. Of course I know about it. One of the victims was from the research institute I invest in. I've suffered heavy losses because of it. It was quite the aggravating incident. Yeah, so no. One of my employees died and that cost me money. Who fucking who? I don't give a as shit. As a citizen, I would like the police to resolve this problem as quickly as possible. Yes, well I'd like you to kiss my ass, but that's not happening, is it? Before they waste any more of our taxes, that is. Bitch, you're fucking rich. You don't you can afford to pay taxes. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm with you, Tama. Jin Furaway. You mean the first victim? Of yeah. course I know of him. In fact, anyone involved in finance couldn't avoid knowing him. Were you close with him at all? Not particularly. I checked. He and Jin had practically no contact with each other. Well, 
He is the director of the research institute I'm funding. Or maybe I should say was. Either way, that was the extent of our relationship. He was quite... well, an eccentric individual. And? I only invested in his work. I don't care what his personality was <laughs> like. It doesn't concern me as long as it doesn't affect his job. Oh, uh, because believe me, if we were going on things by personality, you would not be rich like that. Was what? there any work-related trouble? Not at all. You seem to be searching for a motive for me to kill Chikara. However, I gain nothing from his death. I have suffered nothing but losses because of this incident. In other words, I am a victim as well. A bit shut the fuck up. And you suspect me of all people. The police in this country continue to prove their own uselessness. Seriously, what is up with this guy? Probably the, sti the three foot stick up his ass. If only he didn't have so much authority. We can <laughs> him and book him. Uh, are we are we sure that like Tama isn't just boss in AI form? Well, hold on now. <laughs> Who's that? The president of Nice Japan. Nice? I'm not familiar. I've never even heard of it. Uh -huh. What were you doing two days ago? February 11th, around 8 p.m., and on February 9th at 6 a.m. What is that supposed to be? Confirming my alibi? Well, yes. yes, well, it's only a formality. <laughs> I see the police have no problem wasting people's time. Yes, getting to the bottom of a triple murder done by a serial killer is wasting people's time. Well, fine. Two days ago, I was having dinner with the Federation of Economic Organizations in Ginza. I was okay. on a business trip on the 9th, and I stayed at a hotel in Kyoto. <clears throat> I just checked. He's telling the truth. He was spotted on surveillance cameras in each location. Uh, I understand you are the majority shareholder of Horidori Institute. As the de facto owner of the Research Institute, I'm sure you must know of its origins and insider <laughs> information. What are you trying to say? Just that. <laughs> Did you know all of this? I did. You provided the capital required to rebuild the research institute, did you not? Yes. The gene therapy research that was being led by Chikara. That research had a great deal of value and potential. Okay. Even with all the advancements in this day and age, there are <coughs> many people who are still suffering from incurable diseases. Are you one of them, and is that why you funded it? Not to mention all of the children who can't live a normal life due to the illnesses they were born with. I have seen the suffering of so many people, precious to me. Shikara's research had the you potential to help all of those people. It brought hope to humanity itself. It's certainly true that his personality and past weren't without issues. And I'm quite saying you even care about your own daughter, Bob Wilson. And I won't deny that the research faced criticism due to its radical nature. Ah, yes, well, at least it wasn't radical sex. <laughs> Still. If it can help alleviate the suffering of so many people, I wanted to put my support behind it. In other words, I invested in the future that research institute could bring us. I don't think you're as selfless as you're trying to make yourself out to be. Tama, is there anyone in Mr. Chieda's family that has an incurable disease? No, and of course, he doesn't have one himself either. His only daughter is completely healthy, and his wife, Kizuna's mother, passed away long ago. Oh, I, I did not realize that. What is it? No, it's just... Is this your first time here? Kizzy's invited me a bunch of times before. Big Sis is very popular among the children, and she is great at keeping them entertained. I... I see. I'm not as good as you, Kizzy. I see. Feel free to come back anytime. Any friend of Kizuna's welcome here. Ryuki, I just looked into Iowan. Okay. I came across some interesting information. What, the accuracy? 23 years ago, a child in their care went missing. Uh... Is that what Yuki? Is that what this is? What? The child was six at the time. Oh, His never name mind. was Uru Somazuki. Uru Somazuki. 
Okay. Oh, never mind. Is that guy going to be the bad guy? Is that, like, missing child going to be, like, the serial killer? It was reported extensively, but he still hasn't been found. I mean, that would... There's a limit to the people you can save. How powerless I am. Really? Perhaps it's necessary to be accepting of help wherever you can get it. Oh, okay, that's not what I thought it would be. Mr. Chieda, there's one more thing I'd like to ask. What is it? It's about Uru Somazuki. You remember him, don't you? Yes. I will never forget. The Iowan missing child. That's what the media called it back then. Okay, I'm checking something. I mean, I doubt there's anyone here who's age listed as 29. But. A masked woman. This one's a sex woman? Probably. Does that mean she's not actually a woman? It's actually a small man. Is that what this is? At? Exception is the whiskey. So there's men that act like ballers, but it really scrubs. So that's the way to go, baby. Anti-aging techniques. So I love with that, with that shiz. <laughs> kind of doesn't upset some completely, which sucks. <laughs> um. Right, I'm gonna check. I mean, Gen doesn't have. In is 22. She's 46. Right now she was 12. Wait. <laughs> what if Jin was that other guy? I mean, that is possible. Jin could be the guy that disappeared. Kidnapping or an accident, the case was never solved. And the child is still missing to this day. What a painful memory. It makes my heart ache. As the chairman, I take full responsibility. But wouldn't you agree that the police should take most of the blame? Not really. After mobilizing so many investigators, they weren't able to find a single clue. Well, I mean, I, I suppose that's... What something. do you think, Tama? He has some personality issues, but he doesn't seem like an evil monster. It doesn't seem like he's lying either. Though, it is concerning that so many mysterious incidents have been happening around him. Yeah. Are we done here? We've wasted enough time, I think. I'll be going now. F -f 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 father What? Oh, no. Oh. Ever heard of a thing called secondhand embarrassment? I just got a fuck ton of that right now. Please let me marry your daughter. <laughs> Mizuki's like the double fuck. I swear I'll give her a good life. I swear it to the heavens. So please, please, give me permission oh. to marry your daughter. I am. I'm legitimately face bombing right now. Like, I, I have, I'm just... 
I just like got my hand over my like, you know, like that thing you do when you have like your hand over the bridge of your nose and you're just looking down. Yeah, I, I, I'm doing that. Kizuna, I'll be coming home late again tonight. Yes. Goodbye, father. Wait, wait! Please don't ignore me! Kizuna, who is this? A stranger. Oh, wait, 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 wait! We met at Matsushina Diner two days ago! You're that unemployed guy, Lian, right? Did you go to the unemployment office? Uh, I'm gonna go tomorrow. That's a no. <laughs> In other words, you're a leech on society. I've never sucked anyone's blood. I don't <laughs> think he was being literal. No job, no education, no manners. Not to mention, you're drinking in the middle of the day. Oh, uh, but this is non-alcoholic. And you dare call me father. To put it <laughs> frankly, I wouldn't touch you with a ten-foot pole. How rude! I'm a human being, thank you very much. And I am not a pole vaulter! In any case, stay away from my daughter. Though no, it's not like she would give you the time of day anyway. <laughs> uh, wait! Uh. Piece of advice, people. Don't be like this guy. <laughs> I know it's played for comedy, and this should be go this should go without saying, but yeah, don't do this. If you're somewhat intelligent at all, you're gonna be like, yeah, no. Use common sense. Izzy's dad must be really busy. Uh, no. I don't just... think that was the issue. Looks like he's feeling down, but his core remains undamaged. Okay. Do I have to talk to him? That guy from Matsushita Diner is kind of a weirdo, isn't he? He doesn't seem like a bad person, but... Uh, he's just not very smart. And doesn't take a hint. Favorite genre? What? <laughs> sure, outside. Okay. Bye, Dotty. Okay. Um, pretty. <laughs> Okay, I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna pause this here, so I'll, uh, I'll be right back.